Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel for another thrift with me. We're gonna go into a salvation that is near me. They have some pretty good stuff sometimes. I found like Lululemon here before for MM LaFleur. Um Lafferty, I believe you pronounce it. And I always find Vince in this store too. So the only thing is that their shoes are pretty expensive now. Like heels are eleven dollars, which I think is a little pricey. But let's see what we'll find today, okay? I'll try to get as much footage as I can. Sometimes it's pretty busy in here. The parking lot's a little full, so it might be pretty packed. And I'm also looking for some martini glasses. We're gonna be hosting our very first friends game night this weekend and i want to make some lemon drop martinis i've been trying the recipe out this weekend and uh, <laughs> i just need glasses because i've been using my pink wine glasses and i only have three of them because i broke one so oh, i hope you guys have had a great day so far let's go thrifting <laughs> we have made it to the second thrift store we actually left our cart at salvation army um i had to go pick up my hubby from the dentist and then we went to lunch and then now i'm at this new thrift store that i really like and we're gonna go in here and see if we can find any goods all right today's our sale day so i'm pretty excited all right let's go inside and see what we can find <laughs>
try things just a little different. We're standing up today, so you know, now I can actually like walk and talk. I, like I went to three thrift stores this day. Um, I got a little footage in the very first one. I didn't get anything there because I went to that thrift store because my fiance had went to the dentist. So he was like, I know that thrift store you like is here. He's like, just take the keys, leave me. And I was like, okay, my <laughs> I went to the thrift store and then he called me and he was like, I'm ready. And I was like, oh God, okay. So I looked at my cart and I was like, do I really want to take this stuff? I was like, or do I just kind of want to like take it to get something? And I was like, mm, the value is like, okay, you know. I did get some cute stuff though. I did find like a new with tag tour top, which they do pretty well for me, but I wasn't like so excited to pay almost $4 for it. I was like, I could get it cheaper. So that happened, left that store, whatever, wasn't mad. We went to sushi, that was solid. And then after sushi, um, I dropped my hubby off at home. I took a car and I went to our local thrift store and it was dollar day. Usually I go like as soon as they open and I find really good stuff. Today I didn't get there until like maybe an hour, hour and a half before they close. So I didn't even have that long to go shopping. So I did get some things. Um, honestly, some of the things that I got, I got for myself, so, but I'm still gonna show you guys. Uh, the other stuff I will be selling, um, they're not listed yet. Hopefully by the time I post this video, they will be listed and active for you guys. Um, so let's get started. Oh, I did get something really good at this store. Should I save it for the last item? I think I will. I think I will, yeah. I found this Adorbs matching set, Victoria's Secret. Look how cute it is. With a matching cami that can also double as like a going out cami. Yes. Yeah, I love the whole laundry wear as like day wear stuff. I think that's kind of hot. Like who's gonna know but you, you know? And this is a size medium full set. Um, all right, the next thing that I found, oh my God, was this adorable free people top. This one was new too. I did see her pull it out. Brand new, super boho vibes. This is adorable. Um, this is a size medium, but it is like an oversized fit, but it has like this beautiful embroidered detail with crochet and stuff. It's like a linen material, perfect for summer that's coming up. Next thing y'all. Ooh, you might recognize this dress from the first video I put out. It is this vintage, uh, la, 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 vintage Jonathan Martin Studios dress. It's the cowl neck polka dot asymmetrical hem dress with that floral detail on there. It is like a chiffon material. This was a dollar. So I was like, yes, I'm picking this up. Super Y2K, really cute for like date night with like some slinky little heels. I dig it. Oh, and like a little like what do you call it? Like a baguette it's a piece of bread now? <laughs> I don't know. Like one of those little like square bags with like a metal chain. That would be cute. That would be really cute. Okay, what else is in this bag? Ooh, this vintage Victoria's Secret slip dress that had no tag and the super kind lady gave it to me for $2.99. I was like absolutely add to cart and it has no size tag but um just by looking at it i would say maybe like a medium uh this is a free people tunic tank that i found this is really cute it doesn't have the uh, brand tag on the inside which is totally fine because as soon as i saw it i was like this is giving me like super free people boho vibes so i looked for the materials tag on the inside and as soon as i saw this tag i was like oh that's free people a hundred percent um it might be like we the free but i still have to look it up and uh, this was a dollar too, so that was really cool. Oh, it wasn't like super popping here today. I thought it was gonna be better. Okay, this little gem. 
I did pay up for. And um, I don't know this brand, but it was just so like, wow, wow, wow. I had to get it, okay? It's by a brand called Gracia. Gra Gra Gracia. Gracia. See? Just like that. Size small. That shit may show. Maybe I will try this little number on. Look. Look. That is a sleeve. That's a sleeve. That's a sleeve. Okay? Look at this little mini thing. This little mini, like, shift dress with these fire sleeves oh my god i so adorable i am freaking out i this needs a good steam it's gonna look good good all right we're almost coming to the fire item all right two more things two more things um oh i'm sorry three more things so we get to that really nice item oh, sorry my face is itchy Okay, and then I found these little adorable slides, little kitten heel slides with a little buckle. These are really cute. Um, these are Don Donald J. Pliner, size medium. Um, they're red buckle. They're really cute. And for like six bucks, I couldn't pass them up. They're adorable. And then I found these adorable things. Sam Edelman Palats. They give me like Mew Mew vibes. Look at those little bow with like the studded detail on there. They are pointed toe, Sam Edelman. The soles are in great condition. I think they wore them once and then they were like done. And these are a size nine. They are too big for me, unfortunately. My mom wears nine, maybe she'll want them. We'll see. All right, and for the grand finale of this store, of this store, we still have another store to go to, um, are these stunning, stunning Prada heels. Yeah, you heard right, Prada. I found Prada at the thrift store. Adorable. Look at that. Look at that. Are you kidding me? Right now, like, I would wear the shit out of these right now, okay? The soles, very good condition. Homegirl before, put one of those little sticky things on there so you're not sliding around everywhere. Thank you. Thank you. Okay? The heel does have a light, light damage to it. And I did bring this up to the lady. I was like, I really, really, really like these. I was like, but they do have a little bit of a flawed heel. She's like, girl, I'll give you five bucks off. And I was like, thank you, madam. Add to cart, please. But I am so happy about these. Oh, I love these. I called my mom after and I was like, oh my God, mom, I found Prada. And she was like, no, you did it. And I was like, yes, I did. I was like, look, look at them. So cute. Alrighty. That is the first store. And then after that, I went to Goodwill. And Goodwill was okay. They were also having their dollar sale. Um, let us see what we got. We're just moving bags over. All right, we're just gonna have a little coffee break. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh, my hubby got us these mugs. They are fantastic because I take 30 years to drink this much coffee and this keeps it warm all day for me yay yum goodwill let's start okay the one thing i do like about goodwill is when they have their dollar days the employees actually go around and they pull that color tag that's on sale and they'll put this rack in like the back of the store with all the color tags on there. Like the color, the sale color tag of that day. And honestly, it makes it so easy to go shopping. Like, honestly, that's the first place I go to on dollar days. I'll go straight to that rack. I'll look through the whole rack and see if I find anything good. And then I'll hit up the rest of the store. Um... I don't think these were in order in the bag. They're kind of like everywhere, but I will try to let you know which ones were on sale and which ones weren't. Um, so we'll just start with the first thing I see in this bag, which is this 
beautiful, beautiful Zoom Zoom by Nikki Leah's skirt. It, it needs a good steam. Okay, so it is wrinkly. Don't come for me, please. I promise I steam all this stuff. And it has this beautiful, like, floral detail all over. It's like velvet. Velour. Velvet. It's like velvet. It's really soft. It's really cute. And it does have, like, a zipper on the back. Um, I couldn't find the top, but this skirt is really cute. It is a size 2. Sorry, size 3 to 4 vintage. So it could be a little bit smaller. Um, this is adorable. You can wear this with, like, a little, your own little top, prom, homecoming, wear it out. You can do a little DIY project, cut it short. But I wouldn't want to ruin the fabric, and um, I'm not good at doing that stuff. So Okay, next thing. Ooh, as soon as I saw these, I was like, is that, is that Alexander Wang? I was like, what? What? No way. No way. Way. It is. It's an H&M collab with Alexander Wang. And I was so sure when I saw the print, I had to verify that I wasn't being like, I don't know just overly excited by seeing this in the store so I had to check on the inside and yes Alexander Wang and H&M collab it is a size extra small I wish I would have found a bigger size but you know what beggars can't be choosers I am happy to take this really cute I did see online um other people selling him but I didn't see this print with the logos on here like this it was just like a solid it was like the stripes, but just no logo. You know, you know, you know what I mean? Okay. Next one. Ooh, this was a dollar. And I didn't find this on the rack, actually. I found this like while I was out and about in the store. This is a Nanette Lepore crop top, neon pink with little heart details in a size extra large. Valentine's Day is around the corner. How cute is this? And it has an exposed zipper detail on the back. I've never heard of L'Amour Nanette Lepore, but um, I picked this up solely based on style because of the hearts. I was like, I would wear that. And then I saw that it was an extra large and I was like, maybe not. All right. And then I found this Panic at the Disco Band crew neck t-shirt. Yes my bad size small yeah i don't know if this is official merch it says pacific pacifica pacifica pacifi yeah the something yeah okay i don't know i'll have to look this up to see if it's like official merch or if this was purchased by so this was like a selling through a company or something like that um all righty next thing next thing oh this super cute little tank it's a ribbed hot pink tank by Vince size medium this is adorable like stuff like this actually Vince does pretty good for me online especially simple little tanks like that um and then ooh, this was a dollar too I could not believe it it is this Hallie Bob um cabana drop waist mini dress this is such a cute brand and if you guys, penny up. If you guys didn't know, this is um, it's also pretty fast. I like the details on there. The color is really pretty too. Let's see what this is. Feels nice. Ooh, it's 100% silk, fancy. Okay. I wonder if it feels so nice. This is really cute. I do pretty well with Hallie Bob. I just sold a um, strapless bodycon maxi dress that did have some flaws on it and it still sold on ebay i think it sold for like 50 bucks so yeah <laughs> all right next thing next thing oh this is so cute it's like giving me groovy vibes it is this a free people striped collar deep b knit shirt size medium this is really cute I think I saw this on one of their ads and the girl was wearing these like corduroy wide leg uh high-waisted pants the pants I loved the top I was like oh that's cute too the whole it's a whole vibe but glad I found the top all right next thing is I found this 
Lane Bryant corset top. This was also on sale. It has that cute little bow detail on the front, lace all over the place. <laughs> you like that? I'm just kidding. <laughs> it has a hidden zipper. Um, it is a size 24. Um, it's in great condition. It doesn't look like it took straps. Yeah, no straps. It's strapless. Yeah, cute. It's like a sweetheart neckline. This is adorable. All right. Next thing. Oh, I got this Express Little. Sorry, the tag stuck. Navy cami with this little detail on the front. That is a white embroidered detail. White embroidered detail. It's a size small. Um, I kind of picked this up for myself. I thought this would be really cute for summer. I could like tuck it into shorts or just have it as like, you know, a go-to cami. I do have camis that I like live in in the summer. That one I could add to it. And then I did find this Free People Intimately tank. This is cute. It's like um, a purple, blue purple, kind of. It's an adorable color. Um, and it is a size small. This might make its way into my closet. Mm -hmm. Like a lounge shirt. That's super cute. I really like Free People Intimately. They have the cutest lounge stuff. And uh, I found these Carhartt um, scrub pants. Elastic waist. They do have the pockets down the front. This is a size regular extra large it doesn't say if it's for men or women so i would have to look that up do you guys know if they make carhartt scrub pants for specifically one gender or are they unisex i'm not sure but they're really cute and they are really soft um next thing that i found is this adorable little hannah anderson children's top look at all the little kids playing and the little hearts and the animals this is cute i think this is like a pajama top this is a size us 10 a hundred percent organic cotton and it's in great condition i don't see any wash wear on here or anything like that it's cute little pajama pj top all right next thing Ooh, uh, this is on the dollar rack and I got this because it was a dollar and this is a Star Wars Galaxy's Edge um, shirt, long sleeve. It feels like linen. Oh, it's a linen blend. Okay. I looked up Star Wars Galaxy Edge clothing in the store to just kind of see like a broad range of stuff and their price ranges were pretty good and their sell through rate was pretty solid. So I figured I would give this a try. I mean, it was a buck, you know, and honestly, I'm a big fan of trying things out for myself first. I do like to see other people's examples, but I mean, I everybody likes Star Wars, right? Mm -hmm. I've sold weirder things. <laughs> Oh, this is too cute. This is this J. Crew Bodycon knit dress. This is adorable. It's like a little mini dress. I think the sleeves are like a three quarter length. And, um, nope, they're not. They're full length. Buttons down on the front, two little front pockets. This is really cute. I really like this. I can't believe this is in the store this whole Oh, this is mine. Like 100% mine. I'm going through my robe phase right now. And I have collected a handful of robes. It's not a problem. I promise. <laughs> okay. So this is vintage Natori. Yes, Natori. It is a size medium. I could not find. Ooh, the nice people who donated this. Dry cleaned it beforehand. You're a doll. Okay, it is polyester whatever we're still gonna take it um it is a nema marcus exclusive not only is this a robe but it is a matching mini slip dress i think this was maybe part of their wedding line look at this mesh neck with the floral detail are you kidding me this is so cute and then the robe oh my gee look at it 
pristine condition look at that sleeve adorable it also has a mesh with the floral and it has the waist tie like when do you ever go somewhere and has the waist tie okay so cute okay maybe it has a little stain on there mm, right there yeah okay that's fine we'll try to see if we can uh remove that it is a size medium and uh oh. look at these big old sleeves through there look see you see what happens when i wear stuff like this okay whatever omg omg i'm falling in love <gasps> y'all yes okay this is straight in my closet y'all okay i might be getting married this year this might be coming along with me mm -hmm, mm -hmm. all right we have a one more bag one moment please all right sorry about that guys my mom called so i talked to her for a little bit all right we just have a few more things left in this haul and then uh, we'll be wrapping up and that'll be it for today's haul. All right, let's, um, I still have a few more closings and I do have some hard goods in this one too, but I saved those for last. Um, I did get this John Varvato's uh, long sleeve shirt. Always does really good for me. I actually want my man to try this on and see if he likes this. It's kind of airy. We'll see. And then I got this Anya. That's the brand right there. It's this stripe sweatshirt. I did not know that they made sweaters and or jackets. Um, I've sold their bathing suits before and their bathing suits do pretty well for me. So hopefully this will go well. Um, but yeah, it's this navy light blue. It's a light blue and white. It's a light blue and white color. It's pretty cute. All right, now we're getting into the hard goods. Okay, I did find this Star Trek, Star Trek 3, the Search for Spock book. And um, I just did a quick like Google picture search and uh, comps look pretty good on this. And I do like the old school books like this. I think they look really cool. Um, and then speaking of books, I did pick up this other one. It's called The Treasury of Damon Runyon. Runyon? 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 I'm sorry. I don't know how to pronounce his last name. Um, but I think they're little stories. Like little short stories. Um, honestly, I don't really know anything about this. I just picked it up because of again the binding like if it doesn't sell like it'll look super cute on the bookshelf or I can even put like a little plant on top I think that will that's like little I think this gives like cozy vibes and uh I like how it smells and last but definitely not least is a brand new still in box Starbucks Hawaii mug Oh, how cute is this? So, right, right, right. All right, guys. Well, that's everything for today. I think we had a pretty good haul. We didn't have to go to three stores, which is totally fine. Um, I'm going to go thrifting again this weekend because Salvation Army is having a $2 day. All clothing items are $2 and I will be in there. I think she also said that there will be marking the shoes and the bags for $2, which is amazing because their shoes are like $12 now. I was going to buy some kid shoes and they were like 7 bucks, and I was like, oh my god. <laughs> Pass. And, um... All right, guys, I will link below this dress because I think it is still for sale at uh, H&M and it was super cheap and um, I took my boots off while I was talking to my mom and uh, put my slippers on. These are Kulabura. I actually, Kulabura by Ugg, cool. Y'all know what I'm talking about. I got these for Christmas and super cozy. Um, 
I can find some similar ones if you guys want and I'll link those too. But other than that, thank you guys so much for joining me today. Please let me know what your favorite piece was. If anybody has any information on that book, A Treasury of Damon Runyon, please let me know. I would love to know more about that. I'll also be doing some research myself and all the stuff will be posted on my Poshmark and I will link that below too. So thank you guys so much for joining me and I hope you guys have a great, great rest of your day and I'll see you on the next one. Bye.